welcome back on info for triple and you are watching a series on power electronics using matlab symlink this is 10th video of this series in which we will discuss about rms block in matlab symlink and you are with paramjit singh jamwal first of all we will discuss why to use rms block suppose we have a voltage across resistive load in the form of square wave and we want to obtain its rms value then it can be obtained with the help of rms block in rms block there is need to identify the frequency of this square wave to obtain its rms value so RMS value of this square wave can be obtained by analyzing the duration of one cycle and it is 1 into 10 to the minus 3 second so it is 0.01 second so frequency of vr will be 1 upon 0.001 that is 1000 hertz so now moving towards the practical session on matlab in this video we will continue the simulation we have created in ninth video of this series so first of all open that simulation file and save it with another name now open library browser and go to simscape power system specialized technology fundamental blocks measurements and additional measurements and here you will find the rms block so just drag this block into your simulation file and fit to view now remove this min block from the simulation and add this rms block in the simulation and now this block will display the rms of vr so now click on rms block to update its setting here first option is fundamental frequency so change it to the frequency of your square wave and the square wave is of 1000 hertz so add it here initial rms we can put 0 and update sample time it is 50 micro second now click okay now save this simulation and run this simulation and open score block to observe the output and now click on scale x and y axis limits so here you can see that first one is our square wave and second one is our rms voltage initially it is zero and after one second it is giving some value initially it is zero because it is a uh, holding the sample for initial 1 millisecond and after 1 millisecond it is uh, showing the rms of its complete cycle and after that it is taking uh, next sample and leaving the initial uh, sample so to observe its exact value we can zoom it here so this square wave form is of around 154.1 volt so this is session for today i am thankful to mr suraj pandey for his appreciating words if this video is useful to you then like and share it if you have any query or suggestions then let me know through your comments if you want to get the notification about our upcoming videos then subscribe our channel and click on bell icon thank you for being with us